there. Today I want to show you how you can uh, dodge and burn in Affinity Photo. Uh, the method will not work the same way as you might be used from uh, Photoshop, where you create a new layer and use 50% grey and then you paint with your paintbrush black or white. The method I'm going to show you will work similar, but it's not exactly the same and um, it is very effective and very simple. So stick with me, we are going right away to Affinity Photo. This picture is open now in the in the RAW converter here. This is called a develop persona, which is a RAW converter. I find it not as good as Photoshop's uh, um, camera RAW but it does the job and that is important but uh, this is not the this is not the topic of the video what i want to do is to show you dodge and burn all right i will duplicate that layer by pressing ctrl and j and I will create a new layer by Ctrl Shift N. So this is an empty layer, nothing is happening there. And this method is very simple, it's very easy to understand and it's very, yeah, very easy to do actually. So I open uh, the, the color panel and um, yeah, what we need is basically both colors, black and white, right? So what I do have to do with, uh, with the empty pixel is uh, to change a blend mode to soft light and um, if I want to dodge, I use white or I press X, just X, nothing else. And then I have black to burn, but I will start uh, with, with uh, dodge. So I will go a little bit here into that picture. I choose the brush tool. I will start with white and I will um, do the opacity on 20, something like that. The flow also low to, yeah, something like that, 20. This is a little bit too much here. It's a little bit too low. And then I will highlight many, many parts of the picture like here. And the reason why I do that is to create depths and uh, a mood, a special mood atmosphere in that picture. I will change to black now, make the brush size big, way bigger, and paint black here, and here too. I'll go down a little bit. the highlights of the trees are on the left side here and I will uh, pull out more depths by by making it even more like to bring forth the highlights even more we'll go down here so on Switch back to black. Oh, I'm gonna take a big one here, even bigger. Go down again. So then here, 
couple of parts which are very distracting I think like the sky you can see here and uh, this part as well um, I think I will um, for the sky part I will just uh, crop a tiny bit here let's go here yeah and for the other parts here which especially this one which i think is a little bit distracting i will use a black brush and just paint the same layer same dodge and burn layer make it bigger even bigger i will go up here a little bit because i want to have that darker So I will close the color panel now and uh, show you what we have done here by turning on and off that layer. Uh, so this is before. It looks uh, quite flat I would say. And now with uh, the dodging and burning we brought in some depth into the picture and uh, the idea here is to lead the eye through the picture with exactly that method I hope it worked out so to make that more dark to take away the, dis uh, the, the bright distraction and also use the dodge and burn tool to lead the eye through the picture and that's basically all Yeah, so I just want to say uh, thank you for uh, watching this tutorial and uh, I hope you learned something new. Um, if you want to do that with Photoshop, that you do it a little bit differently. You will um, create a new layer and uh, so basically you go to layers in Photoshop, um, new layer. And then, uh, like here, it just pops up, but in Photoshop, uh, you will get this uh, little pop-up. And um, there you can uh, choose uh, what you want to do with it, if you name it or whatever you want to do. And there you have that option, 50% gray. Uh, so you click that and uh, you choose that option, 50% gray, and then you go to your blend mode, soft light. And uh, from there, you will also use your brush tool and uh, switch between with a, with a, with a button X between white and black, right, like here. And uh, then you can do the same dodge and burn as well. Yes, uh, thank you for watching. Wish you a nice day. Goodbye.